Hello everyone, I'm Edward and welcome to Windows Report. In this video I will show you how to check your computer's serial number on Windows 11. The first way to accomplish it is directly from the operating system and that is using the command prompt. Click the Windows button, then simply type CMD, then right click command prompt to run as administrator. Then in the following window just type in one of the following commands and press enter. After entering the command you should get a response with the exact Windows 11 serial number. And if you wish to find out what your PC model number is, then type in the following command and press enter. That's it. This method is the same as the one people used in Windows 10 since command prompt hasn't changed at all. You can also check your UEFI for the serial number. To do so just restart your device and while restarting you will be briefly asked to press a certain key during the booting process. Press that key, which usually is delete, F1, F2 and escape until you open the UEFI settings. Once inside the UEFI just look for the text containing the serial number. Not every manufacturer uses a similar UEFI interface and it usually depends on which motherboard you use, so you might not see the same UI like this one. And lastly you can also check your PC hardware's box. Another way to check your serial number is to simply take your motherboard's shipping box and search for a sticker that contains the number. Manufacturers will always print the serial number on their boxes together with other information such as the production batch for example. And keep in mind that you need to check the motherboard's box specifically since it is the piece of hardware where the BIOS is installed and where all the other of your PC components are connected. In case you have a laptop you can search for a similar sticker on its sides or on the back since they usually also come with this information. And additionally if you received warranty service the company responsible for the warranty should have included the serial number in a mail or some form of document. That was easy, isn't it? As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.